good morning it is day one of my keto lifestyle and I'm super excited to start it and basically what I'm doing is um, not really morning exactly <laughs> like I usually work at night I work from home I do graphic design and so I usually stay up until sometimes 5 in the morning which I actually did and so um, I woke up, I've been up for like an hour or so, just doing some stuff around the house, and I've been sipping on electrolyte water, um, so I don't get dehydrated, and I'm basically doing some meal prep. I'm actually cooking some chicken in here, I put some salt and pepper and some garlic powder, and I put it to a boil, and now I'm going to let it simmer on just like medium-low. Ooh, steamy. And I'm going to actually make a chicken salad with celery and I think some red bell pepper I might put in there and I'm going to put it on these um, in the back here, these lettuce, these romaine lettuce hearts. And I have a couple other pieces of chicken and I'm just marinating while I put them in like olive oil and balsamic and some Dijon and some seasoning and some garlic. Um, these yogurts, we have to get rid of those guys. And so I'm going to make my first keto coffee and um, I've been using the uh, Keurig for a couple of years and I just got the Nespresso right here for Christmas so um, I like it. The coffee is really delicious. I'm not really, I'm just like one of those people I get into a habit of using one thing and then I um, have a hard time switching over. So I think this actually might be really good for keto coffee because it just has, it's more flavorful and you can almost drink it without sugar and cream. I'm so used to having sugar and cream. So what I'm going to do with my keto coffee is, and like this is just experimental, but I got some Kerrygold butter, which... I didn't invent keto coffee by any means, but um, I found out about it on YouTube. So, and I'm going to use this heavy cream. So, that's what I'm going to do. And I wanted to find an organic heavy cream. That's literally the only one they had at the store. So, I'm going to have to do some looking around for um, babes. So, that's what's for um, my meal plan so far. And I'll check in. So far, I've had some of this water and now I'm going to have a coffee. I'm going to keep sipping on the water. I'm putting these items in my coffee. No sugar for me. And then I'm going to make a chicken salad and I will let you know when I have that. Okay? Bye. You guys, this looks so weird, guys. Like, um, I just put two squares in here and I'm letting it melt and it just looks weird. <laughs> I never would have ever thought of putting butter in a coffee. I don't know if you thought of that. Um, I sipped on it black so I could kind of sip on it after the butter goes in it and like see what the taste is like and I'll let you know. And I have the heavy whipping cream which I have not added yet. So I'm just letting this melt. Okay guys, I am back and I just want to show you what this looks like. Um, the butter is melted basically for the most part and it like rises up to the top. So do you see when I fold it over, the butter sits on the top and oh, and when I stir it in, it definitely looks creamier. I hope you guys can see this, it's a little dim in here, but um, it looks creamier and I'm going to taste it, okay? Okay, a taste test. Oh god. Oh, it's not good. It just tastes like coffee with butter literally and you can kind of taste the separation it doesn't really meld very well but I'm gonna go ahead and add some heavy whipping cream real quick okay so I just put two And voila, it's like a, I like my coffee about that color, so that looks tasty to me. Let me try. Mm. Um, it's not bad. I can 
totally tolerate it. And usually I have a bunch of sugar in mine. So guys, this could work for me. Um, I see the separation. It just totally, the butter rises and it separates completely. So you definitely have to keep stirring this, but if the taste is not terrible, you can totally tolerate it. And I actually ordered this monk fruit um, sweetener and it's totally acceptable for keto and I'll actually link it below. So this is what I am doing, my first keto coffee. Thanks for watching guys. Guys, so I'm sitting here in my living room trying to enjoy my first keto coffee and as you can see how yellow the butter is totally on the top and the coffee is like under it. Um, <clears throat> I've drank in the majority of it. I'm down like two thirds of the cup. And, um, dash, got it. And I'm drinking quite a bit of my water. Um, I'm not gonna put butter in my coffee for a while until my taste buds adjust. It just was not palatable. I ended up adding two stevia, organic stevia packets just to make it a little more tolerable. Um, I love coffee. I'm definitely gonna finish it up and Primarily because um, headaches and stuff like that. I don't want to get a headache from not drinking a coffee. And um, yeah, it's not that delicious. And if I have another one, I'm just going to start using the heavy whipping cream. Not heavy. Yeah, heavy whipping cream. And yeah, that's just what I'm going to use for now. So that's where I am right now. Okay, guys. So I'm about to eat um, for the first time today. I had my... Um, keto coffee earlier. I only drank about two-thirds of it because I just couldn't really do it. Um, I've already added it into Fitness Pal, but I'm not going to change it. I'm just going to like leave it. And um, so what I did, I'm starving. Um, like earlier I said, I'm actually going to, I'm cooking this right now because I want to make some chicken salad for lunches, but it's still cooking. I want it to be like super tender so I'm gonna let that keep cooking and so what I did was my husband made some steak earlier and so I just uh, measured out with this food scale two ounces of the steak and sliced it I'm not warming it up I'm just gonna nibble on it cold I have a baby bell cheese and a pickle and I drank this water and I'm done so I'm gonna head on to my next water and this is kind of like a small lunch I guess this is day one guys so I have no idea if I'm doing this right but I'm about to log this into my fitness pal and enjoy this little lunch okay guys